Harrisburg School District makes plans to rebuild after damage from last month's storms. Good evening. The press box, the bleachers, and the scoreboard at Taylor Field in Harrisburg were all damaged by high winds on May 14th. School leaders aren't wasting any time replacing what was lost. News 3's Ryan Kruger joining us now live with more on this story. Ryan? Well, Angie, that press box that was destroyed at Taylor Field is used at least 15 times a year. It holds members of the media, coaches, scouts, and scoreboard equipment, but it was destroyed when strong winds blew through Harrisburg. And with football season only a few months away, school leaders say it needs to be rebuilt soon. There's a big, empty gap at Taylor Field in Harrisburg after last month's storms left the press box in shambles. And now there's a sense of urgency among some leaders in the school district to rebuild it. I think anything can be done. It's just that we need to decide what we're going to do. And if it's going to be, you just need to give me the amount to work with it. At Tuesday night's special meeting of the Harrisburg School Board, members agreed to spend no more than $50,000 in rebuilding a new press box. Any more money will have to come from other sources. I'm not opposed to doing fundraising. God knows. Yeah. I spent the sure. last nine months people doing fundraising. So people who want a bigger box we should do with, fundraising. We for now, the plan is to rebuild the box in the same spot. This is a proposed outline of what the new facility would look like. But before moving forward, school board president Todd Fort wants to make sure that this won't happen again. I'd like the architect or structural engineer to look at whatever we do to make sure it's going to support it. While a budget is in place and drawings have been made, Superintendent Dennis Smith says a contractor needs to be chosen soon in order to be ready for next fall. Every week is just a week chopped off. I mean, if we're going to build it ourselves and it ends up being that way, I'm sure that a contractor can throw other things off of the schedule and get up there and do it. And when the press box was knocked down, it landed on several rows of bleachers, damaging them. Now, those bleachers have been removed, but there are plans to rebuild them.